Dr. Stephen Businger here uh, from the University of Hawaii the Meteorology Department. Again, he was my professor when I was going to weather school at the University of Hawaii. And we'll start uh, with just your overall opinions on the, uh, the look and the health of this storm now compared to about six hours ago. What are you thinking when you're looking at these satellite and radar images? Well, it is true that the storm is becoming less symmetric, and mm -hmm. that's good for us because the less symmetric uh, signature of the storm later in time means that the wind shear is starting to take hold. Mm -hmm. And that wind shear is, is uh, as uh, Howard said, it's taking the top of the storm and, and tipping it over. Mm. And that causes the sea level pressure to rise. Mm -hmm. Another thing that I see on here is I see a lot of convergence in the flow toward the Big Island. And that helps explain why it is that the Big Island has been ex experiencing so much precipitation. And as that moves northward, I think the other islands can expect to see some heavy rains start uh, sometime tomorrow.